today's collectible spot, we're having a look at bandage and scab plush figures. Bandage and scab? Yes. Pick me. Indicated up at the top there. Pick me exclamation mark. You can go to www.purpleflavor.com. Purpleflavor.com and get your very own bandage and scab. At the very top, there's a scab and there's the bandage. Friends to the end, right there. Friends to the end. On the back, it says bandage and scab. Reasons for picking a scab. You see what they did there? You see what they did. Scabs are delicious. I'm not sure about that. Wanted to snuggle it. I'm gross and weird. My cat was hungry. I suppose you could check off any one of those or all of those if they all meet your criteria. It is a removable scab for adults only. Copyright 2009. It says thanks, Ginger. Okay, thanks, Ginger. Um, what I am going to do, though truth be told, there's not much in the way of packaging, but what I am going to do is I'm going to get this opened up when we come back. We're going to have a better look at bandage and scab. So definitely stick around, guys. There's more heading your way. Stay tuned. Out of packaging, you'll get yourself a full-size bandage. That is a considerably large bandage. Not one-to-one -one scale, I'm sure. And then on top of it, you've got scab. Now, scab's not going anywhere. Oh, no, he's not. He's pretty attached to bandage, as sometimes most scabs tend to be. Oh, that's the worst, is when you've got a, a scab. Ooh, and you've got the bandage on top of it. And mom always tells you, take it off quick, but we never do. We never do, especially when you get older and you've got hairs, arm hairs, hand hairs, finger hairs. Taking that bandage off don't make it any bit easier. You rip it off, sizzle, sizzle and not delight. Anyways, the bandage is attached to scab. Scab is attached to bandage via, via a Velcro strip. Um, on its own, the bandage is, a, it feels like it's got a little... Um, Perhaps something inside. It's a denser material. I suppose you could wrap itself around something. For giggles, I guess, if you wanted to, you could put that on your arm. A full-size bandage, somebody would say, that's a pretty big bandage. And you could say, I got a pretty big scab. And you would not be lying, because attached, again, to the bandage was scab. I'm not sure if scab is happy or sad. He's just kind of cum si cum sa, as they would say au francais. He's got some black eyes, he's got a red mouth. But he seems like a happy little guy. He's plush. A fairly uh, dense plush as well, so he's not too too incredibly squishy. On the back, though, he does have the red Velcro. I would have liked if the Velcro on the back was brown to, of course, match scab. But uh, he is very fun. Um, it's one of those things, sticking it back to bandage, and yes, of course doing the Dairy Queen Blizzard test. It ain't going anywhere. Um, it is a fun novelty. Obviously, perhaps not for everybody, but for giggles, I think it's a fun, really a fun collectible indeed. If you're interested in picking up your own, you can go to www.purpleflavor.com. You can get yourself a bandage. You can get yourself a scab. You can have friends to the end. Because usually when bandage goes, Poor scab goes with him, unless you've got one that sticks around and it's not good for anybody. Certainly stick around though, guys. Certainly stick around. Spots got more collectible spots heading your way. See you guys next time.